Hi, I'm Jared Hemmert, and I'm an addict. Dr. Hemmert was arrested in 2006 for trying to buy painkillers with a fraudulent prescription. Utah dental regulators let him get outpatient treatment and keep working. They didn't warn the public. That approach failed, but the state took over three years to figure it out. Along the way, Dr. Hemmert was arrested twice more for driving while intoxicated. He also ordered extremely large amounts of mind-altering medications. And while impaired, the state said he injured two patients. They lost viable teeth. I started out with back surgery that I had back in 2004. I became addicted to pain medication. At the time, I didn't know or think I was addicted to it. But uh, later, that was obvious when I started getting in trouble. We found cases of drilling while intoxicated all over the country. Last fall in Tennessee, police arrested a dentist on the job after a witness called 911. 911, where is your emergency? <clears throat> yes, ma'am. I'm down at the Cheatham Family Dentistry where there's uh, Dr. Stephen Kaufman is working on my nephew. He's drunker than a skunk in there. This is a damn dentist and he's drunk inside of there trying to pull teeth on people. An Oklahoma dentist was accused of slurring speech, drooling, and pulling the wrong teeth on two patients. He allegedly also overdosed patients on an anesthesia. The Tennessee and Oklahoma dentists lost their licenses, but Utah gave Dr. Hemmert another chance. He went to inpatient rehab. The problem with that was I didn't do it for me, and I, I ended up needing to go back in in, in 2013 after a severe depressive uh, episode and an attempted suicide. Dr. Hemmert says he learned desperately needing coping skills at a second treatment center. Now he speaks publicly about addiction and he's working as a dentist again. I'm not afraid of life anymore and that's amazing. Now um, it's all about living life in the present moment. It's not about being hindered by my past or stuck in my past, and it's an amazing way to live. And I'm grateful for that.